Welcome back to The Run with Manny Wilson. My guest, Justin Black, is still here with me. Oh, we talked about the Cowboys earlier, so now we're going to bring up some of these NFC teams and mostly talking about the Saints and the Rams. In my opinion, I think those two are the most dominant in the NFC right now, but yeah. but then again, the NFC is loaded with competition. NFC is loaded. They are loaded with competition. So in Man. your opinion, who do you think in the NFC will go to the, to the NFC, the conference game? I don't know. This this may surprise you. You know, I think that this team is is really being slept on. Oh my! Nobody's God. paying attention don't to them. I know you. They tough. I don't, I don't think you know what I'm saying. Okay. I mean, it's kind of obvious, but you know, I think the Carolina Panthers, man, Ooh. with Cam Newton. <laughs> listen, okay. listen, they got North Turner there, Ooh. and and they turn be- turned around Cam Newton, and and Cam mm-hmm. Newton is made. They're like, playing good. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, tough offense, it. tough defense, a strong head coach, and and like, I I feel like the the thing that will hurt the Panthers is home field advantage. Like, <laughs> I feel like the Saints now they could beat the Saints if the Saints are at home, but uh, you need to play a nearly tough. perfect game. If the if the 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 Panthers really want a shot at you know getting to the NFC Championship, mm-hmm. they they really need to somehow get a home a home field advantage. Now I honestly feel like if they, I can see them playing the the um, the Rams in the second round, and I don't know if you've been watching any Rams games, but their home games aren't home games. You see, you see <laughs> different team. You see the you see Packers fans in the stands in LA. Playing, yeah, yeah. So their home games is not really an advantage. So if they play the Rams at home, and the Rams, you know, they're still slightly inexperienced in the playoffs. I feel like. If they play, if if the Rams play the Panthers in the playoffs, which I think Panthers they they them. yeah definitely, I think the Panthers will get them. Mm-hmm. And depending on how things shake out, I can see the Saints and the Panthers being in the NFC Championship. Okay, Paints or Paints, uh, Saints, <laughs> Panthers, Rams. Those three teams are crazy good, and those three teams are also in the same division as my favorite team, Atlanta Falcons. Oh goodness! So my division is packed. My division is loaded. Yeah. So somebody out that that NFC South division is most likely going 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 to the Super Bowl. You still got faith in the, in the Falcons? Of course, I always got faith uh, in the Falcons. Even though even though we ain't been playing the best, but I look at it two years straight. We done beat we beat teams in our division to get further and further in the playoffs. Last year, people said, "Oh, Rams about to spank the Falcons." What happened? Falcons came they out there and no we won. They but, had no experience. And that's their fault. We ain't had that much experience either, but we came out there and got of it done. Of course you had playoff people, experience. You had Matty Ayers. <laughs> you got Julio. <laughs> of course you, you, you played in the Super Bowl the year okay. before. Of course you that's got That's okay. That's okay, but we earned it. We earned it. We had to get to the Super Bowl. We had to beat teams in our division to get to the Super Bowl. Let's see if you make the playoffs this year, okay? Let's take it one game at a time. Okay, and I am taking it one game. That's why I'm not talking crazy like we get into the – I didn't say we was going to the conference game. I'm yeah. just saying – I'm talking about the Saints, Rams, and the Panthers. I know my team beat those teams, especially we beat the Panthers in the in the playoffs last year. Or I think – what, what was it, wild card? Or, or something like that. Or first round, one of them. First round? We no, beat, no, because the, the Saints played the Panthers in the first round last year. I remember We, that. we beat a good team. We – we beat the Panthers within the last two years, though, in, in important games. Close games, yeah, we beat man. the Panthers. We should have beat the Eagles. It was a good game. The Eagles did win the Super Bowl yeah. last year, so we lost to the champions. And I'm like, you know, that's over. They ended up winning yeah. it all. So, so we what, lost to the best team in the NFL, yeah, technically. We're not even talking about the, the defending Super Bowl <laughs> champions. But they're like, in the NFC. What happened to them? They're in the NFC. That's another team who can possibly win a game. It's it's tough with the, with the NFL because – it's literally one game. You get one chance. You get one chance to play your heart out. And if you lose, then that's it. Now, all right, I'm going to get back on topic. I'm going to leave the Falcons alone. I do think if we get in the playoffs, we we have a chance of beating people because we're a good team. We just got to play right at the at the right time. We just got to play good together. We'll and we don't do that all the time. So that's where our downfall is. But if we do get in the playoffs, we probably can pull off a few games and, and hopefully some miracles. And getting yeah. getting <laughs> the some, conference some miracles. game. You're gonna need some miracles. <laughs> we can probably get the conference game. But if my Falcons don't get there, I think the Saints is going. The I, Saints. I thought the Saints was going to the Super Bowl last year, but they got they didn't get robbed out. They, uh, uh, one they person definitely got robbed. One yeah. person made a big mistake. Yeah, rookie. And it, oh man. Yeah, and it cost them. It cost them the game. 
and that was their chance of, of getting to the Super Bowl. And I thought they would have won the Super Bowl. But I, I definitely believe they're going to get back to the conference championship game. They're going to win. The Vikings are good. The Rams are good. You said the Panthers. Those teams are all really good. So it, it's going to be tough. It's definitely going to be a definitely. battle. Definitely going to be a battle. Saints is for sure the one team I think is going to get there. Unless they play the Falcons. So what do, you, what do you think the matchup is going to be? NFC Championship? NFC Championship. Saints... If, if we had the little the plaques to put up on the board right now, I'm putting the Saints up there. Okay. That's one. And I got about three teams for that other team to go against the Saints. Three? Uh, three. <laughs> but I'm going to go out there. I'm going to just go out because we beat the Rams before. The Falcons beat the Rams before. I don't. It's going to be tough to do it again. It's going to be tough to beat any team twice Please in the playoffs. Tell me you're going to put the, the Falcons <laughs> out there. Let uh, me get there. Is, I'm, I'm going to eliminate teams. I'm going to eliminate teams. Rams, you said it yourself. Don't have that much playoff experience. They're a good team, great team. But if they get home, you never know what might happen exactly. if they play at home. <laughs> exactly. They got a really good record, so they, that home field advantage is looking really good to them right now. But we don't know how that would go. I'm knocking the Rams off. Who, who, would, who's who's I, knocking the Rams out? I, if, if Falcons play the Rams, I feel like Carolina can beat the Rams. Cam Newton can definitely get oh, it yeah, done oh, against yeah, most the Rams. Definitely. I'm, I'm predicting that, yeah. Mm-hmm. I, will, I will pick Cam Newton and the Panthers to beat the Rams. They would be up there. Vikings have a really good defense. I like Kirk Cousins. He'd be pretty sweet to me. Yeah. But, like I say, anybody can beat anybody. So, it will be close. It, I don't know what next team I would knock off between. Because you got the Eagles there. But... I think the Eagles. They're gonna be tough too, though. I think the Eagles. I mean, to be honest with you, I, I'm. It'll be. Good. I'll be surprised if they make it to the second round. They don't really look that good this they, year. They, they I haven't. See, they I, been I see no same. consistency really. Like they ain't been looking the same yeah. at all. Not nowhere as near. But like I say, anybody can beat anybody in one game. It's one game, literally. That's it. True. I, I wouldn't put the Eagles in there though. They, they're definitely not gonna be up there. I would. I'm gonna just go with it, man. I'm just gonna say it, man. I'm going all out. I will put the Saints and the Falcons in the conference game. Oh That's what I'm going God. with, man. I'm this, like, is, look, this is straight look. for as a fan. This is, <laughs> no, this is like a fan. All right, I'm going to say the Lions. I'm going to say the Lions. Right, this is my on. team. I'm going to say the Lions going to make it in. Look, right. look, let me explain. Let me explain it. All right, let me explain it. Our schedule, we play the Buccaneers again. We play the Cowboys. We can beat the Cowboys. We can beat the Buccaneers. I think we play... The Saints again. Every time we play the Saints, it's always a close game. Definitely, so if we definitely. see the plane, if we, if we see the Saints, it's a close game. We gonna fight for yeah, sure. Yeah. It's always a close game when we play the Saints. We usually always beat down on the Panthers. Whoa. We, we get them work when we play the have, Panthers. Have you guys played the Panthers this year yet? Yeah, when we beat them. W- were, you, were you at home? I can't remember if we was home or not, but I just know my team walked away with the win. Okay, all right. I just know we'll, my team we'll walked see, away we'll with see. the win. I need to. And we I beat need the to Panthers. see. I need to see if you'll be at home or I think, not. I, actually, I think we were at home. Yeah, because yeah, if, we if, you, if you're going on a roll, you're not beating the Panthers. <laughs> I doubt it. Well, you never know. You never know. Like I said, it depends on what Matt Ryan shows up and what, what the play calling is going to be that game because it can be tough, man. Like We don't we have not been playing good. As an Atlanta Falcons fan, we've been playing really iffy. We beat down on bad teams. That's how our record is getting better. This is all been, fan. You're, this is like just <laughs> the fan you coming out right now. Because I'm not, I don't even think the look, Falcons are going to make the playoffs, to say the truth. It's tough. And, and you got to go game by game. You got to go game by game. They're not making the playoffs. I'm, I'm sorry, <laughs> but they're not. They're like, going to get you, the playoffs, like, man. I, I'll take the Seahawks over the Falcons. Like uh, that's We talking NFC. <laughs> we talking NFC. We keep the Seahawks on, on their division. We know, we know who coming out the AFC. No, no, no. It's NFC, Seahawks NFC. No. It, oh, yeah. Yeah, Wait. the NFC. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right, they are. Right. They have yeah, the yeah, same yeah, division okay. as the Rams. Yeah, they're not going to do that. Yeah, I'll, I'll, take, I'll take the Seahawks over the Falcons. You're going to take the Seahawks. Seahawks? Come on, man. No. Yes. You don't really do me like yes, that. Yes, I will take you... the Seahawks over the Falcons any day. Who does the Seahawks have besides Russell, Russell Wilson? Russell, on, last name Wilson. It. Come on. Just because Russell Wilson yes. can beat down on that, y'all Lions. That man will carry <laughs> the whole team. Just because he can he carry. He beat the his... Detroit Lions. He can it's do... the Detroit Lions. <laughs> Just because he can beat down on y'all Detroit Lions. 
Don't mean he gonna do the same thing against the Falcons. My Lions is a tough squad, man. Don't talk down on us. Look, y'all, squad. y'all got a new coach and all that. I give. I was hoping y'all did good. But, you know, look, things didn't work out for y'all, and things that I'm not talking. I don't want to talk trash because my team is not in the best predicament to talk trash. It's okay. I don't right talk now. trash. We suck. I know. I know. <laughs> but in terms of the NFC, I'm going with the Rams. No, not the Rams. The Saints and the Falcons. Just because in the past we've beat the teams. That have always so called been better than us, or or had higher odds to win. When we played the Rams, they had higher odds to beat us, and we beat them. When we played the Panthers, people thought the Panthers would beat us, and we beat them. When we played the Saints, we I well I thought I thought we was so, gonna beat us, are, are, but it was a close game. We usually always put up a. If we get to the playoffs, we can do some damage. So what you gonna tell me? They're going to the Super Bowl now? I'm not telling you that. That's go go not ahead. That's what you want to say. I, I can tell. Not. That's what you want to say. <laughs> go ahead and say it. They're going to the Super Bowl. Look, we are a four and four team. I'm Is not that... telling you we're going to the Super Bowl right now. Maybe after like a if we maybe if we get to the playoffs and get a few wins, then you might hear me talk about Super Bowl. They'll okay? finish the season nine and seven and right outside of the playoffs. They're not going to the wow. playoffs. Wow, you gonna give me a nine and seven? Nine and seven. That is rough. Nine and that's seven. that's tough, man. You gonna yes. give me a nine and seven? Nine and seven. They're not. And not even. To... We ain't gonna get a wild card. Nothing. No. No, because the NFC is so tough. Like, like we're not even talking about the Packers. We're not like Billy. Packers, but it's just Aaron Rodgers. It's Aaron just Rodgers, Aaron. Aaron Rodgers can get you to the playoffs. And I get it. He's a miracle man. I yeah, get exactly. it. <laughs> but it's literally just him. It's just Aaron I'll Rodgers. The, I'll take the Packers over the Falcons. You know what? I'm telling I, you. I would, I, come, come on now. I'm telling come you. On. I wouldn't do that. I, and I understand our defense for the Falcons is not the best. We ain't got the best defense, so that's really going to be... You got a lot of injuries on defense, too. Yeah, that's, that's what's killing us, really. That's going to be our big downfall, so we're going to have to outscore everybody. Exactly. But you got to look to my you gotta look to, to my point, though. We got the offense to do it. We but got the offense when, to outscore when, teams. When you talk about playoffs, you, like, this high offense is cool, you know, when it's hot outside in September and all that. <laughs> oh, my but, God. But when you get, when you get in, in oh November, December, January, like... When you get in the playoffs, like we talking playoffs, Tom, we talking playoffs, not like, practice, not practice, playoffs, playoffs. <laughs> like you need defense. That's when defense shines. You right? What and, if, but what if our defense step up? No, no. So l- listen, but here's here's my NFC championship <laughs> predicament. I think everybody is raving about the Rams, but they've shown shown a lot of weaknesses in the past couple weeks. They have barely won their last few games, and they just lost to the to the Saints. Now. I think the Rams are a very good team, but when it comes to playoffs, playoffs, I think the Panthers have the offense and the defense. Like, the Rams are very vulnerable on defense. I think the Panthers are tough on offense, tough on defense, and they'll beat the Rams in the second round of the playoffs. And I'm predicting that the Saints and the Panthers will be in the NFC Championship game. And I think it'll be a close one. I'm actually rooting for Cam Newton to go back to the Super Bowl, but I think... The, the Saints will go to the Super Bowl. I, I Okay, look. I agree with that. I, I think the Saints get to the Super Bowl. Saints go there. I see Brady getting back to the Super Bowl. I don't think nobody about to beat Tom Brady. But I, I do see the Saints. Uh, and the, and we gonna, I'm going I'm to stick to the conference game in terms of the NFC. I'm going to stick to the Saints. I'm going to look for a team with good offense and defense. And exactly. I'm going elimin- to eliminate my f- fandom of Atlanta Falcons. Yes, finally. So, finally. <laughs> now, I do think we still are contenders in the playoffs because anybody can beat anybody, and we do have the offense to outscore people if if we come to play. If we come to play, we can't outscore people, but like you said, you, you made a good point. The playoffs, you do need a good offense and you do need a good defense. You need both. Teams with both Saints, I can see the Saints getting there. I can see the Vikings. They got a hell of a defense. Kirk Cousins makes that offense so much better. He makes that offense come alive. Yeah, they've been doing good. And and they if if they are rolling and they playing good and and they go on a, a good run toward this last stretch of the, of the regular season, then I I can give them my vote to get to the conference game, get back to the conference game, and they can prove to everybody that how they got to the conference game last year wasn't fluke, or that they can prove that they're a better team and and. They deserve to have some kind of respect 
I, I don't see Kirk Cousins, Kirk Cousins being more than like a, a player that gets you to the second round of the playoffs. I can't wow. see I can't see him playing in the, in the He's underrated man in the NFC Championship game. Only way I can see that is if he has the the necessary. Uh, weapons around him and the incredible defense. Now, but he got good. He got good weapons on his offense. He does, but that, I think that the, whole t- that whole offense is underrated in my it, opinion. It, very, it, it really it's, is. But I feel like underrated. I feel like the defense has shown a lot of weaknesses, and they've shown that you know you can probably put up quite a few points on the defense. And Kirk Cousins is just not the player that I think will take me to the promised land. So I can't trust him to but, you know make but the. But you got the. the the pan, well, I can see Cam. Okay, I can see Cam, but the, but the, I'm I'm kind of confused on Cam. I don't I don't know. I don't know. Last year, he got there and and they team just fell apart. It looked bad. It looked bad when I think we played Falcons played the Panthers last year and they just looked bad offensively. So I don't know if it's a, a get to the playoffs. You know when the playoffs get there, things change. I mean, last year in the playoffs against the Saints, Cam Newton was like a pass away from beating the Saints. Like. If uh, I forget the rec- receiver's name, but if he was just like made like you know dove for the ball or something like that, it was like a he was a few inches away from catching the pass to to put them up against the Saints, and um, yeah, they they were like a pass away from beating the Saints in the playoffs last year. So you know it, you know it was just like one simple player. It was like the players who from them, you know, I, I think the, the Panthers are, are always contenders with, with Cam Newton and uh, the head coach that they have and Ron Rivera and the defense that they have. I think, I'm telling you, man, they're so underrated as a team, as a squad. They, they're the I feel like they're one of the most balanced teams in the NFC. Ooh. Ah. Either way, we can agree. We can agree that the Saints are going to get there. Oh, yeah, we agree that. Right. I, and, like, Drew Brees is throwing, like, one pick this year. So, yeah, definitely up there for MVP candidate. And he uh, broke about six records. He, oh, man. he just been doing his thing. Yeah. I, I give all the credit to Drew Brees. I hope he, I actually hope he wins it this year. I the would MVP? love to see him finish off this year by with a ring. That's, that's a that's – a, That sounds oh, like a good story, don't it? It, it does, actually. It does. <laughs> it's not like a good story. That's even a, though, I like the young dogs. I like the young dogs to be in a you know Super Bowl. Give me. I mean, we're not talking AFC right now, but give me like you know Pat Mahomes versus Cam Newton or something. Like oh, that. that'd be nice. I like that. But I'm, I am tired of seeing the Patriots get there every year, man. It's it's been too long. I've seen the Patriots get in the Super Bowl way too much these last few years. Most definitely. It's, and they usually win it almost every time. I thought they was gonna win it last year too, but I was. It caught me by surprise. Oh, definitely. I didn't see that coming. I and I don't think anybody coming. in their right mind actually seen that coming. Oh, definitely. I didn't see it coming. <laughs> and if you did, you was really gambling and you just took a long shot. I actually, but, I wanted the Eagles to win, but I didn't think they were going to win at all. So. I, did, I didn't want the Eagles to win. You didn't? Nope. I know I know an Eagles fan. I, I actually hope you listen. I know an Eagles fan, and <laughs> I just I can't. I, I couldn't go for oh, them. I couldn't go for them. And then the Eagles beat us. Wait, that's why you're mad. Oh, yeah, because the they beat, the, beat Falcons. the Falcons. Yeah, too. Yeah. And they only beat us by, like, four. So it, I'm like, no, nah, I can't go for the Eagles. No. I was like, Brady, bring it home. <laughs> I wanted Brady to bring <laughs> hey, it home. Hey, he tried. He threw 500, 500 yards. So. Oh, man. He, I don't know.